Hello everyone, my name is Julius Sizzle and this is the SCP-173 tutorial. My voice is horrible but meh. Now, 173 is just a zombie with an armor stand constantly being teleported like this. The zombie's name is SCP-173 and Dash 2 is the armor stand. Execute as zombie teleport armor stand to its current location. Always active. Turn off previous output for all the command blocks to reduce lag. So let's summon a zombie, which I killed before here. SCP-173 gets teleported immediately. Now it affects. So it affects resistance, fire resistance, invisibility, and then speed 9. The rest is all maximum. Except this, which is speed 9. You write 9, it gives it speed 10, and I don't know what happened. What? Well, it doesn't really matter, because I already affected it. So that's the effects. Now it's the blink. You get a 1 second repeating loop, which is 2 max repeaters, 1 with 1 delay. You put like that, press on. This is 10 redstone ticks, which is 1 second in real life. So you put 2 command blocks, 1 removes the XP, and 1 removes the scoreboard thing, which is scoreboard players at a... I mean remove at a blink 1. Remove 1 from the blink, which is there. To make the, to make the objective, you do scoreboard objectives and then you write the name like blink and then dummy and then repeat it for the display name i already did it so yeah i, I also added a display so you can see it working so that's the blink uh nice containment cell with heavy containment zone wall so we put another thing to test for a repeating command block to test for not test for scoreboard players test at a all players blink give it a margin of safety negative 3 0 so if it lags it will likely still work now we remove the block right here change this block right here to air which is supposed to be a redstone block so that it doesn't repeat itself And then set forward one or two blocks, which is for here set block. Negative five, four, three, redstone block. And then you can just do the same thing here, but make it air. This is to again ensure it does not do the command twice. Here will set block somewhere else to activate the blink and this will remove all XP levels from everyone. In case your lag again and your XP is different. Not this is not 15. So let's make the blink thing for this is supposed to be look detection but there's not enough space. So this is the blink timer. Not blink, I know, the blink. Here you can remove the block right here, 940. And there you make it with some block. Here you add XP. 15 seconds, so you add 15 levels to everyone. And here you put whatever delay you like here recommended is this somewhere like this and you do this it's the blink itself so put two command blocks here but I'll just do one first here you do the this is the blink which is a retextured out uh, a pumpkin replace item entity all players slot dot 
armor dot head slot ID one carved pumpkin copy the command block paste here not paste just put it down air change it to air so now see blink then right here you do anything until you make the detection this is just the blink you don't need anything else unless you want a lock detection which is quite simple yet difficult so you need an armor stand that is called anything you like let's do long line and you execute as scp 173 but actually you should do the player act test for the 173 You can do it both ways, like ex execute as 173 test for player or this. 15 blocks, so it only activates the teleport of the lock line when you're 15 blocks nearby. Now you execute player. You can do this or you can do this, it doesn't matter. TP, lock detection. Do arrow up keys, which is relative to where you're looking. Do plus 5 for the first one. I'm not gonna do the rest because it will take way longer. So, plus 5. This will teleport the look line 5 blocks in front of wherever you're looking. Then you execute as the armor stand, which is look line. Test for name equals to scp173 do r equals to 4 which is no wait inside do r equals to 4 which is the width of the facility my one at least there that's just the lock detection now get a repeater i mean a comparator repeater and then after that A command block on repeat that affects SCP-173 slowness for one second 255 which is max so one second is important because you need the quick delay I mean short delay only one second delay then you put a repeater in between affect weakness Same thing, leave a space here that you will set block, You for the rest you just do similar thing and you hook it up here. Now over here in the blink, blink itself, you put a, for the first blink where you add the curve from green where you blink, uh, you will set block here which is right before the two, com two effect for 173 to air so you, you remove the lock detection basically and then right after that you clear its effects you clear 173's slowness and weakness So now he can kill you when you blink. Uh, if you want to make the blink actually work a lot, like he can move a great distance when you blink, you have to make this very long, which looks really bad. So I didn't do it in my map. And then to just undo all this, you just do the same thing. But you change it back to restore wire. And then after that, you set block. No, it's not block you scoreboard players all players set i mean set all players 
a blink 15 which is resets the blink to 15 and you set block back there which is 542 with some block so I had to change a few things uh, a bit only I had to change the coordinates because I put it wrong and I changed this to repeat so it will delete this block like it, just now it didn't maybe lag I'm not sure so now let's make our Where's did my lock line go? Okay, now let's Here's broken containment Okay, let's look away I got wrecked there he went over a command block, that's why his position changed. Or oh, redstone did. Ow. Look, if I'm looking at him, he can't kill me, but now he's flying around because he's too fast. Okay, now he should be lost. But he still walks a lot. He looks a lot better if he's slow. I'm. Okay. The blink isn't working very well. I think it's because, yeah. Look. The long, the long detection is too slow. I mean, the blink here is too short. Let's see. Do not do this because it looks ugly. He's pointing at me. Oh, that's just that's SCP-173 in Minecraft using command blocks. Yay! Without RIM or RI with like a ton of commands, it's just this. Hey, you actually moved a lot. So. Yeah, I will probably do more voice videos when I do tutorials. Bye. <laughs>